I just opened my blinds to get some nice light in here, and as soon as I do, a gigantic moth flies out at me. Nice way to start a video, eh? Hello, Shining All the World. It is Thursday. Um, I'm sorry if I'm talking kind of weird right now, but if you can't see, I have some white strips on my teeth because I'm trying to get my teeth to look all nice for prom because that's in about two weeks from now. So, um, I wanted to show you my dress, so I'll go get that. This is my prom dress. It's a whole bunch of different colors. It, I got it from Macy's. But I'm absolutely in love with it. So yeah, this past week and this next coming week are going to be a very busy time for me. Um, this Tuesday, I went to see Edward Sharp and the Magnetic Zeros um, at the city with my friend Amanda, who you've met before on this channel. And they were so good. I mean, I can't even explain to you how amazing they were. We got up to the barricades in the front, in the center, and I got to like hold his hand like three times and it's not even just like the when you walk by and then you touch their hand or whatever no we were like our fingers were intertwined guys if you haven't listened to them or you haven't heard of them before i'll put a link in the description of like my favorite song or something because you have to listen to them <laughs> that was really the pick me up that i needed because i've been so stressed with this test that i have tomorrow and right now i've just i've kind of given up on it it's on ap us history and i have just been like cruising along this whole year just getting by and now that the test is here I'm just completely screwed and I don't want you to think that I'm stupid I'm not it's just that for this particular test I just don't care because it doesn't matter and it doesn't really count towards my GPA and it's really only for college credit so since it really has nothing to do with what I'm doing in the future I just I don't care so that brings me to this week's theme of what we want to do when we get older. Now, I didn't really know for a long time, but now that I finally figured it out, it's really been moving fast. So I decided that I want to be a veterinarian, and that's going to be a really long haul for me, because it's four years of undergrad and then four years of grad school. So what you have to do if you want to really get the ball rolling is that you have to start, like, now doing stuff. So trying to get a job at a vet's office as a veterinary assistant. And I think that'll be really good for me if I can get it because I have a lot of experience with cats. I've had cats all my life, but I really, I've never had a dog. So I just, I'm not scared of them. I just, I don't know what to do with them, kind of. So that'll be good, getting some experience with that. Um, dun 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 dun, looking at the list of things. So Simon, I wish you the best in getting a job. Just keep going, you can do it, and good luck if you if you can um, get your way to London. That'll be really cool. And Kez, don't bring yourself down. I've seen some of the stuff that you've done, and it's really good. And I'm not just saying that because I'm your friend. I'm saying it because I really mean it. So don't bring yourself down. You can definitely get really far with this. Okay, so you see the moth now? Ah. He's like, these are like are the sticky ones, because if you've ever had these before, you know that they kind of like slide around and stuff. So they're really gross. But these ones, they st they're stuck to my teeth, and it really hurts. Ugh. If you've ever had these before, you know how gross these things are. Yeah. So that's it for me. I really enjoyed your videos this week, and next week I have something exciting to show you, so keep, keep tuned for that. So uh, I'll see you next week. Bye!